Synaptic vesicles in functional nerve terminals undergo exocytosis and endocytosis. The overall goal of our experiment is to image this vesicle recycling using fluorescent FM dyes. This is achieved by first bathing neurons in an extracellular solution that contains the FM dye in order to stain the newly endocytosed synaptic vesicles based on specific synaptic activities. As a second step, a dye-free extracellular solution is applied to remove the dye that is inserted into the extracellular side of the plasma membrane and of synaptic vesicles that were loaded with the dye. Next, allow the synaptic vesicles to undergo exocytosis and lose the FM dye from the vesicular membrane and lumen into the extracellular space. Results are obtained that show FM dyes can be used for monitoring the synaptic vesicle destaining. The main advantage of our method is that we can monitor weak synaptic activities in the absence of stimuli in addition to strong synaptic activities in the presence of stimuli. So the method makes it possible to study any combination of synaptic activities during staining and destaining phases. This method can help answer key questions in the field of synaptic transmission, such as how different forms of vesicle recycling can change under a wide range of physiological and pathological conditions. I'm Saruhiro Yabuchi, a postdoc in Harata Laboratory. Today, I will demonstrate the procedure for monitoring weak synaptic activities. 